So first off, am I going to be able to get you guys to fight if I if I push in the right directions? No, no. never. No. We'll hug it out Good before luck. we fight it. <laughs> no, we love Good each other. Luck. That's no fun at all. <laughs> well, okay. So for each of you, if it turns out that you win tomorrow night, what will it sort of be validating? What will that win mean about what you did on this show? Um, I think it. I think it kind of shows that you're um, able to dig deep and, and the mental stress more than anything I think on that show was really challenging yeah. and um, there were times that I know watching the last couple episodes I can see I'm at the end of my rope I, I can see I'm, I'm about ready to break mentally and, yeah, and seeing push. our family didn't know that, that it, while it was great and it was lovely and all that it didn't exactly help because it, it made you shift gears for a second and you and you're, you were reminded that you actually have emotion <laughs> and that yeah. there's life outside of Hell's Kitchen so yeah, that was that was kind of bittersweet. Um, you're getting pushed. You're really getting pushed to the limits, and and uh, you know we're really putting it online every day. Yeah. And um, you know it, it's 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 an emotional thing to go through. And quite honestly, I don't think that you know even with the the winner being revealed tomorrow, um, I think Justin and I both sitting in this chair, you know, it, it shows how much we were able to achieve amongst chefs of different levels of ability in a kitchen we weren't used to cooking in under the standards of Chef Ramsay without our normal releases that many chefs, you know, you need after a, a hard shift, so. With different personalities. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but is it not a validation of, of one of you being hypothetically the better chef than the other? I don't know, I don't know. I don't think it, it's, like, it's so relative, that, that kind not, of who's better. And Justin and I are so different in our cooking. Our cooking styles are so different. Yeah. But at the same time, um, we respect each other so yeah. much that it, it, it's it's a very difficult thing to answer. It's not, I don't think it's necessarily who's a better chef, it's just who's a better fit for, for that kitchen, for the job yeah. that he's offering maybe. Um, and again, it's in that role, you're, you're cooking under Kevin He, who has been with Chef Ramsey forever. So um, I think it's just, yeah, I, I don't think it's indicative of who's an actual better chef. I think it's just what he's looking for in, in that Las Vegas restaurant. I, mean, I think that we, Proved enough just sitting yeah. here right now. I, yeah, I mean, I agree. personally, I feel that way. I'm proud. Of, I'm proud of both of us. Yeah, we love each other way too much to ever <laughs> ever take it there. Well, there are so many cooking competition shows mm -hmm. on TV at this point. So, what sets apart the Hell's Kitchen winners from the winners of Master Chef, from Top Chef, etc., yeah. etc.? Why well, are you guys going to be different? I think it's a, a Master Chef is a completely different format. Obviously, he's not. He's trying to help somebody launch a career. Whereas with Hell's Kitchen, he's trying to yeah, he's trying to get somebody to further their career in one of his already established restaurants. Um, Top Chef is another completely different animal. I think that they don't they don't have, they to, don't go have to go through, through the living, the actual living situation. Whereas we're in a dorm with seventeen strangers, you no, know, seventeen competitors. Yes, yeah, yeah. that too. Seventeen. So it, it's a little bit different in that regard. And we're always on set. We never leave. We live above the kitchen. We cook in the kitchen. We go upstairs. We go downstairs. That's all we do, except for yeah. those rare days we, that we're that's why winning either a cleaning is, a dumpster or, yeah. Winning a challenge is such a big thing because yeah. you, we actually do leave and the kitchen. And you see life. And you see, <laughs> and you see a person walking their dog and you're like, man, what's that like? Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. It's you, really, it, I mean. It's, it's, it's difficult. And like I said before, yeah. I, I mean, I challenge anybody to come out and try it out. Now, after the first season of American Idol, they did the movie from Justin to Kelly. What would the movie? <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> what would the What would the movie from Justin to Christina? I think Christina it would be, be from Christina to Justin. Maybe I don't know. Oh, that'd be kind of freaky. Yeah, let's do it. I don't know. That'd be I think good it would movie. be a yeah. whole lot of yeah. trouble. Is what it that, would probably yeah, be. Yeah, that, that would have to be a, a pay-per-view uh, special, actually. <laughs> I I spent a few probably. Oh my god, I spent a couple nights in uh, New York City with Justin. You know, relaxing and uh, is that what yeah, yeah. Relaxing? yeah, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's it's an afternoon show. <laughs> I think. We should call it relaxing. Um, but yeah, I think I think the cameras would actually really love really it. enjoy following <laughs> yeah, us around. We have it. a good time together. Then you throw Dane in there every now and again, yeah, just spice um, it up. You'll definitely get some. This is really action. taking yeah. a turn that it shouldn't. Yes, I think it would be a fun movie, yeah, and I would be all the way right? down for it. <laughs>